Okay, so basically I got honey, hydrogen peroxide, and some graphite right here. I put a thin layer of honey on the uh, styrofoam plate and the um, uh, graphite on top of the uh, honey. And I'm gonna take hydrogen peroxide, just put a tad bit on there. And when I lift up the plate, lower it down, just kind of gently roll it into there. As the peroxide works on the sugars, combines into, I believe, water and um, CO2. If you just go back and forth. You see at the very top, see that film? It's actually pieces of graphene. See if I get closer. See that right on top? Those are pieces of graphene floating. Those are pretty big pieces too. And I think the I think the reason why it breaks apart is because the um, the um, the surface is uneven, so it kind of tears apart, you know, as it's coming up. And you see the heavier stuff, you know, sits on the bottom, but the lighter stuff, the pieces of uh, uh, graphene right there, they float on top because there's like thousands and thousands and thousands of um, water you know molecules underneath underneath it so it's more buoyant because it's a lot thinner um the other way i was going to try was to put some on a um, strip of um, put it on a strip of uh, paper that i put a bunch of crystal sugars on I'm gonna put some, just rub some graphite on there. Let's see if we could do that. It's just sugar. And here is the hydrogen peroxide. I don't have an assistant today. And indeed, there we are. They say it works a lot better. See that? And kind of, you know, go back and forth to get all that sugar off of it. But anyways, if you're able to, I guess, cleave as much as you can, you can, in theory, put graphite on top of uh, a sugar surface, a surface with uh, sugar, and then just cleave it until there's only, uh, you know, a few layers or one layer of uh, graphene left and then you can add your uh, peroxide to uh, dissolve the sugar and then you're left with that well I hope this helps and I apologize the other video was really cruddy um, I had some issues with that and uh, I hope that works for y'all